and welcome. This video is brought to you by the streamingadvisor.com. Tailor your entertainment with streaming. And what we're looking at today is the new Minix NGC1. This is a new mini PC. It's one of the fanless ones, but this one's running Windows 10. Just a little bit about the hardware, just to get us started. It has a quad-core Celeron processor, Intel graphics card, CPU, or sorry, GPU. It also has 4 gigabytes of DDR3L memory and 128 gigabytes of internal storage. Otherwise, it's pretty similar to everything else. It's got, you know, Ethernet port, power cable, things like that. But I just wanted to let you get a look at it. We also have a full demonstration of it ready to go that we're going to let you see after this video. So, this is it. This is the actual box itself. It's a very heavy, heavy-duty box. It has ports here on the back to hook up two different antennas. You just screw them right on. Kind of, kind of look like little ears. Look like a like a bunny. <laughs> okay, so, but that's the antennas. Those help you get the best Wi-Fi connection possible. I actually always recommend Ethernet connections. On one side, you've got three USB ports as well as the power button. You can use that to turn it on and even reset it. You know, you can get into the Windows shutdown mode pretty easily from that. On the other side, on the back, you have a number of things. As you see, you've got an Ethernet port. You've got the power area. Got an optical audio, HDMI, a headphone jack, and another video connector right here. So, that is it. There's no SD card on this one, unfortunately. But... There is still a lot of potential for connections. Most importantly, you can hook up thumb drives and USB drives and USB hard drives and just really expand what you can store on this device. But in general, I really do like what you get from this. This is, like I said, it's a heavy-duty Serious box. It's it's a premium price. That's so three hundred dollars or three ninety nine. Uh, and you know, yes, that's expensive. But what you get for it is a pretty serious small PC that you can use as a desktop replacement. And next, we're going to show you what it looks like hooked up to the TV. We'll be right back. <laughs> 